Hi friends, this is Audacity Tutorial, Beginner Series, Part 5. This is last in this series and in this part, we will see that how we can save our project and export audio. In previous parts, from installation to editing, we have seen it and in this part, after the editing, we want to save our project or export final audio. So these two are different things. Saving projects means you want to save project for the later references or work on the same project on a later time. So let's see that first. Go to file menu. Select save project as. Normally it will give you a warning. Save project for an audacity project not an audio file for the audio file that will open in other app use export click ok give it a name for example i want to give it a name demo 3 and save so project is saved this project can be opened on a later time and this will open as you see on a screen right now with all the three track separately and all the edit and splits you have made everything will be i mean look similar manner when you open the project again on the other hand when you export audio all the three tracks will be summed up in a single audio file and export the audio in a distributable format like mp3, wave or some other compressed or uncompressed format. Let's see that. Let's see first how we can select an area and export that part. So let's make a selection first. So when I make a selection, I can export only this area in a single audio file. Go to file menu, select export and select export selected audio. Now you can give it a name. I just remain it as a demo 3 but you can give any name you want to and select mp3 which is very popular format to distribute and share with other people and standard preset variable average and constant so you can select variable or constant and you can give it a bit rate normally i select 192 kbps which is very uh, standard and good quality mp3 file but you can also give a lower bit rate like 128 Or 160 I'll not recommend you go below 96 because that's where the file start showing the inferior quality audio and 320 is the highest in the mp3 uh, file standard so select 192 and save the track will be mixed Okay, one thing I just forgot to tell you, when you select export to an mp3 or any other, so there is an option, joint stereo, stereo and forced export mono file. Mono files will, de uh, I mean, just sum up all, both the left and right track in a stereo and create a mono file. Joint stereo is a uh, actually a smaller file stereo but smaller in size because it uses a technique where the common information signal audio signals are sum up in single track and only uh, the difference in left and right are saved in a stereo file so you can select joint stereo but i will recommend select stereo and save your track will be mixed down to two studio channels in the exported file. Click OK. Now, this is MP3 tag. 
you can give artist name track title album title track number year zona and comment this is optional in case you want to give you just fill this uh, columns and click ok and file will be exported and saved in a desired destination so this was exporting selected area of a file and if you do not make any selection entire file will be saved in a single audio file go to file menu again and select simple export and you can see that export selected area export selected audio is grayed out now export as an mp3 export as wave export as org and export audio when you select export audio it'll give you the similar same options and a few more options available here AF, wave 16 bit which is standard wave file wave 32 bit float other uncompressed files mp3 org vorbis flac mp2 mp4a aac basically which is is aac file ac3 amr wma custom ffmpg export so you select any of these to export your audio depending on the target work you want to uh, use it for so normal standard is wave or mp3 if is apple uncompressed wave is microsoft windows uncompressed standard so either you select wave 16 bit you want to save in high quality and mp3 when you want to save in a compressed format to share through emails or something like that so select one of these options and save okay and file will be saved so this is how you save your uh, project and export audio in audacity in case you have any questions any doubts you can put in the comment section here and i hope you enjoyed this beginner series videos and you have learned something see you in next video thank you